informally, a graph is just a bunch of dots and lines connecting the dots. It's actually very simple. So here's a graph. These are the nodes, and they're connected with these lines that are called edges. And often the nodes and sometimes the edges are labeled. For example, we might call this x1, x2, x3, x4, x5, x6, and x7. All right, that's an example of a graph. Now, this being a math class, we've got to give a formal definition of a graph. And we'll usually use the formal definition. A graph. G is a pair of sets, often called V and E, where V is a set of elements called vertices or nodes. And it has to be non-empty here, in this class. And we'll go back and forth between vertices and nodes. Even in the text, we use both words interchangeably. And E is a set of two item subsets of V, and they're called edges. So for example, over here in this picture, V is the set of nodes is x1, x2, x3, up to x7. That's the nodes. And E, the set of edges, is pairs, unordered pairs of vertices. So for example, x1, x2 is an edge. And it's the same as the set x2, x1. Doesn't matter the order here. Later, in a week or so, we'll talk about directed graphs where the order matters. x1, x3 is also an edge here. And so on. I think we've got, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 edges in this graph. And you, the last one would be x5, x7.